Hi, I'm Tasneem. Welcome back to my channel, The Tutorial Shop. So, if you don't subscribe my channel yet, please subscribe my channel and hit the notification bell button. And if you like my videos, don't forget to give a thumbs up and you can comment down below. So far, we have learned uh, many basic things about Microsoft PowerPoint. Uh, in my previous videos, if you don't uh, check my videos yet, please go to my channel and you, you can find the basic um, basic videos about Microsoft PowerPoint. Um, so, so, so we have learned many basic things about Microsoft PowerPoint. And today, I want to talk more about the picture. Actually, uh, there are many things to do with the picture in Microsoft PowerPoint. You can use picture as a background. You can you can customize your picture in different way. So, I guess you know how to insert picture in your slide. So first, uh, I'm, I'm, I will show you how to use picture as a background. So to insert picture, you have to go to the insert tab, then click the picture option, then select the picture from your computer. Insert. So increase the picture size. Uh, we have to resize the picture first. But see, the picture doesn't feed the feed my slide, right? It's a bit larger from my page slide page, right? So I'm going to put it at the center and select the picture. You will find the option like crop. Click here, click here, crop, and then click uh, and. Uh, you can find some points like this so drag the points until you want to crop your pictures so i want to crop my pictures um, i want to crop my crop this portion of my picture so i have dragged my points until there and from here i want to crop this portion now after after dragging what you have to do you have just have, you have to just simply click crop again then our picture will be cropped okay then there are many more options actually there are option like crop to shape you can select your picture and select here there are many shape like you want to crop your picture circular then you can crop your picture and in a, in a circular shape if you want to crop your picture like any other else shape you can choose that also so you can crop your picture in any shape or you can crop your picture according to your slide um, according to your slide page okay 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 i want it as rectangular so now there are many more options actually um, there is a ratio here you can crop your picture according to your ratio here is 1 is to 1 here is 4 is to 5 here is 4 is to 3 you can also customize here and if you click the crop button again the picture will be resized according to your ratio okay so i'm leaving it as it is so now uh, there are some options like picture border uh, i i have already described about this uh, this in my previous videos you can go and check so now I want to show you how can you use picture uh, as a background as a background. So if I want to write here, write anything here, you can use, you can use text box here. If I write anything, change the color, increase the size. So it, it is not looking so much clean or so good here, right? So what we have to do, we have to make the pictures, um, if we make the picture a little bit blur, if we um, decrease the light of this picture, then this 
uh, this uh, word sunflower will will look more good in this life right so in 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 that way you can use our picture as a background so select the picture you can find the option here name correctness so click here then you can find some option like for the first row there are option uh, sharpness and softness if you click here it's a it's a bit blur if you click here it's less less blur if you click here it's sharp more sharp and more sharp so if you move to left from the middle the picture will be blur and if you move to the right from the middle the picture will be sharpened right and and here are some um, some more option uh, brightness and contrast so if you click here the um, the brightness will uh, decrease and the contrast will also decrease if you go left the brightness and contrast uh, the brightness will be increased and if you go down the contrast will be decreased and you can see the change okay so what uh, so if you want to uh, um, if you need more brightness or if you if you need more contrast or if you want to um, soften more you can customize your options like how here is an option like picture correctness correctness option you can click here and you will find the dialog box like this and you can use any kind of percentage here you can increase sharpness if you go right the sharpness will increase and if you go left the picture will be more soft and the and the softness will be increased okay the picture will be more soft So I'm leaving it as soft and then you have option brightness if you if you go left the brightness will decrease and it, it, it's, it's black now because the brightness is 100% brightness is minus 100% that means it's it's dark and if you go right the brightness will increase and it's now white because it's a maximum brightness right so this is how our brightness is changing okay so i want a bit darker background so i am choosing brightness less brightness and here is another option contrast uh, it, it works same like brightness and softness so you can decrease contrast in that case the color color contrast will be more lighter and if you you can increase contrast and in, in that case your color contrast will be more darker okay so i am using 21 percent of contrast and close okay now if i write anything here text box Now you can find uh, the word more visible, like right? The word, the the the, the background is now uh, looking good, and the um, the word sunflower uh, is it's actually lo looking good, and the picture is working as a background of this uh, word sunflower or, or of this text sunflower. Okay, in this way you can use your picture as a background. So that's all for today mm, so i'm going to uh, end this video so uh, if you don't subscribe my channel yet please subscribe my channel and like my videos and if, if, if you have any confusion and if, if you have any suggestion for me you can comment down below bye